Hey guys, so The Witcher 3 is an amazing game. I love playing it. It's been one of the best games that's ever graced my console. I have reacted to a couple of the trailers, but one I missed is the Blood and Wine DLC launch cinematic, and I have had some people request that I react to this one. I don't think I've seen it, so I'll quite gladly sit here and check it out for you guys. It's a win-win. All right, full screen, three, two, one, go. A good life is best described using simple words. Honor, wisdom, valor. The virtues we cultivate were bestowed upon us. They became a code, our code. So vibrant. Some say we strayed from the path of virtue. And the gods sent the beast to teach us a lesson. I say we simply hire a beast slayer. Don't let them fool you into thinking it's just another contract. This land has never seen such unspeakable evil. of love and wine. Exactly how I remembered it. Nice. May 31st, 2010. 2016. I was way off. I don't think I've played that DLC because, one, like I said, the connection to my man cave, the, the PlayStation 4, just doesn't get any signal. So trying to access the PlayStation Store is an effort in itself, much less downloading something over one gig can take up to like 90 days. Don't worry, I'm getting MBN and that's sure to be better. It's the broadband network. I'm hoping so anyway. That just makes me want to play the game again. And it's also got me very excited for Cyberpunk 2077 because these developers are amazing. They really know how to craft amazing gameplay and visuals and storytelling. So I'm excited for that. But The Witcher is an amazing game and I want to play it again right now. So I'm going to turn you off and go do that. I'll catch you all in the next one. Thanks for watching.